In order to fully understand a culture, you've got to understand and know the language. In order to know and become fluent in a language, you've got to immerse yourself and know the culture. Um, and once you put those things together, it opens the door to relationships. It was a blast to work with Truett. He's really taken advantage of a lot of things on campus. Uh, he's thrown himself into his studies in linguistics. He's been involved with the chapel band uh, every year that he's been a student here. And the Elijah Project gave Truett a great opportunity to grow in his own self-knowledge. The Elijah Project is made up of kind of three portions. You have a class, an internship, and then a community intentional living. What we try to do is uh, weave those contexts together in one sustained conversation about big questions. What does it mean to be human? What does human responsibility mean? What do we mean when we talk about vocation and calling? For the internships, we try to place students in opportunities where they have a chance to learn more about themselves and more about a field of work that they're really interested in. The internship, I worked in Australia studying an Aboriginal language and working on revitalizing and documenting it. I've developed an appreciation for the defining aspect of language and how it really defines a culture. It really helped solidify my identity as a person and just really trusting in God's provision. You know, the deepest transformations in a human life are very time intensive. They require attention and space for a student to engage the questions that matter. And it often involves a relationship with a faculty or a mentor who can walk alongside them, investing time and attention. For me, I've been blessed by the relationship that faculty and students have here on campus. Dr. Carmer models so well what it means to be hospitable and compassionate and humble, how much care he has for other people, the compassion and kindness that he shows them even if he disagrees with them. There's a lot of different ways we can spend our time and attention. We can invest our talents. A lot of things we can trade our lives for. Our students have opportunities and choices all over the place. We want to help them discern wisely about how to invest their talents in a way that's going to most align with what God's doing in the world and who He's made them to be. Being here at Gordon has really prepared me for the future to interact with people different from myself as well as different cultures and different languages. I'm glad I went to Gordon. <laughs> I'm glad that I'm going to be graduating from here. The unique opportunities I was able to have has formed and shaped and challenged and encouraged me in who I am. I wouldn't have found that anywhere else.